When mothers pray, things happen. I want to share with you a story that will encourage you, especially if you're a parent, to pray for your children. This story of Marzi, a mother in Iran. Her son had an accident 10 years ago. He had his teeth broken, face disfigured, and he was in coma for one month. After he comes back from coma, he was depressed. So he starts with drugs. She says, my son was a drug addict. He would sell everything, even steal our appliances and sell it to feed his drug habit. She said, I was so depressed. I would, I would ask God, kill him and kill me. Took my son to drug rehabilitation and even psychologists with no result. And then she says, one night. One night I was watching Christian television. I watched you and you invited me to become a Christian. I prayed and my life was changed. And this is what she says. God healed my heart and gave me a spirit of intercession. I started standing for my son in prayer. With hope and confidence, I would pray, God, you were his father be before I became his mother. Have mercy on him. I prayed for two years. Every night after he went to bed, I would go to his bedside and pray for him. Whenever he used drugs, I would intercede with tears. After two years of prayer, God answered my prayers by appearing to my son in a dream. The next day, when he was telling me about his dream, he was so happy and excited and his eyes were full of light. He prayed with me that day to accept Christ. He was set free from drug addiction instantly. Later, God gave him a Christian wife. Today, we have a house church meeting in my home with my son, daughter-in-law, grandchild, and others. My son's face, now listen to this, my son's face is still disfigured. But when he smiles, I see Jesus smiling. I thank God daily that he changed my life and set my son free. My son may still have an ugly face, but he has a beautiful heart, a transformation because the mother got saved and she prayed for his children. You may have children who are not walking with God or may not even be saved. I want to encourage you with Marzi's stories that there is hope if you and I just continue to intercede for our children. Sooner or later, they will have an encounter with God through vision or through a life transformation. Let me pray for your children and our children. Lord, I thank God that you have given us children. Lord, we have burdens when our children are not walking with you or when they don't even know you, but we understand when we believe in the power of intercession. And right now we stand for our children that they may have a fresh encounter with you, that they may be saved, Lord. We want our children to share in this joy and salvation that we have with you, Lord. And thank you. That thank you that you hear the prayers of parents, especially the prayers of mothers, and you do miracles. We expect a miracle for our children. In Jesus' name, amen. I hope you're encouraged. I want to thank you especially for standing with us to share the gospel with people like Marzi. You know, when a mother gets saved, usually the whole family gets saved. And not just gets saved, she plants a church in her home. God bless you.